Good afternoon, this is Gabriel Jackson, and welcome to Allah Day number 1108. Allah Day keeps the eights our way. There's a custom to study the laws of a holiday 30 days before the holiday. So Passover is coming up. We're well within those 30 days. Let's learn a little bit about Passover. Before we do that, there's, a spe there's special laws about the month of Nisan, which is coming up this Thursday. The month of Nisan. That's the title of the chapter. During the entire month of Nisan, we do not say Tachanun. Tachanun is that part of prayer where we fall down on our arm um, during Shachras and Mincha, morning afternoon prayers. We do not say it the entire month of Nisan. Nor do we say Tzidikadin, which is a special prayer we say during the burial service. Um, during the month of Nisan, we do not say it. And we do not say Tzidikasecha, which is the special prayer we say on um, during Shabbos Mincha. We also skip that. It's a short prayer, but we skip that. Okay. It is customary from Rosh Chodesh on, once again, Rosh, the first of the month is coming up this Thursday, Wednesday night, Thursday, to read from the Sefer Torah, the Torah portion of the Nasi, who brought his offering on that day. Now, we're going to see that the custom nowadays is really, most people don't do this. There are some shuls that do it, but most shuls do not. Um, it says here, this custom is not very wide, widespread in our times, except among Hasidim. It says also, for number five, the leader of each tribe was called Nasi, a prince. On Rosh Chodesh Nisan, which again starts this Thursday, the tabernacle was erected, and in honor of its dedication, during the ensuing 12 days, each prince had his day on which he brought a special offering, as it is written in Numbers. So to commemorate that, some shuls, again, read that Torah portion related to that. They usually do it after prayer altogether. Okay. On the 13th day of the month, we read in Parshas Be'aloisicha until Ken Asa Esa Menorah, which means, so did he make the menorah, which is fitting for the tribe of Levi. It says here, Aaron, the high priest, and Nasi of the tribe of Levi did not take part in the offering of the princes. His lighting of the menorah was his part in the dedication, and that's why we read that part for those synagogues that do this on the 13th day of Nisa. And that was your halach. Thanks for listening. Mwah! Two sponsors, future halacha 36, 100 for the gold. See you tomorrow.